Good morning folks. Happy 1st of December. Is Heidi sucking her fingers? Anyway, guess who's arrived? Hi Ellie. Hi. Guess who's arrived last night? Yes, they are back. Where are they at? One falling over, drunk already. Where's your mate at? Oh, he's up there, look. Yeah. Sue is just upstairs getting them all ready. And they're all going to come down. I'm going to give them a shout. Come on then! Come and see if they've been. Oh dear. Casper and Dave. Oh my goodness! That's a lot of stuff. What, what are them there? Is this a little is gift? This no, no, I think. Look at them. It's a little gift. To say it's hello. A little gift. They, Hi. them giant things. They're advent calendars. Those are advent calendars. So yeah. They look nice in my hand. I know. Are they cool? They're massive. I'm not sure who's the dude to be honest. Where's I can't one? remember. Where's I think that's one? the older girls. Is that one? Oh, I see sparkles! Where's Buddy at? Buddy's there, sparkles over there. Sparkles, Buddy. Right, tuck him to your nice healthy breakfast. Oh, hang on a minute. Chocolate. Chocolate. Right, there's pancakes, there's um, strawberries and bananas. Uh, Right, okay. Make me sing. He's in your other calendar, girl. Where's he at? There he is. Dad, I got this out of my pocket. What is it? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know myself either. There you go. So you've all got one. There's a joke. Oh, Casper. No, you're right, see? Yeah. Oh, I got a joke! I got a joke. Come on then, you can't beat a joke at this time of the morning. I got two jokes. Oh, wow. <laughs> What's green covered in tinsel and goes ribbit ribbit? Now I don't know. A frog. A minstrel toad. A minstrel toad? I think that's how it says. A tinsel toad? Is it? It says minstrel. I don't oh, okay. know if it says tinsel. Oh, where do you get the Hilarious. So we're just giving the kids their advent calendars. I need to go through them all, but I think that's Max's. Peppa Pig. Oh, that's yours, Oscar. Okay. <laughs> that's Bonnie's. No, Bonnie. Bonnie's. Where is she? Um, Bonnie. Bonnie's. That's uh, Max's. That's yours. That's yours. That's yours. That's yours. I actually has got like a little lap like time on your one. This one is Casper's. You're still tired, darling. There you go. Yeah, I, I would have to do it as fast as I could to make it. Right, play. now listen, you only have to do one at a time. One right? door a day. Okay. Yeah, right. Yeah? Two other doors. I found my door. Right, so we need to, uh, I think Katie's got that. Hang on a second. Well. Yeah, if you do that. Uh, okay. Hey. hey? Yeah? Ooh, fingers are all sticky so it really hurts. Oh, I got some chocolate milk from there. Oh, look at this one. Okay. Ooh. Oh, come here, sweetie. Look this one's yours. Yeah. Where's Heidi? Chuck the thing on the floor, why don't you? Chuck the floor. Where's Heidi? Oh, oh yeah. Bonnie, look. Yeah. 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 She doesn't yeah. get this, does she at all? Let's what open the door. Let's open the door. Hang on, hang on. It's a big one. Oh. Right, open that. Open it. Oops, open that. See what's in there. Okay, open that. There, what's in there? What is it? Oh. What's that? What is it? It's a tree. It's a Christmas tree. Jump up your wheels, Casper. Can you not do it? Don't cry, we're not allowed to cry. Hang on, don't rip the box. I'm getting this. Oh, come on, Dave will get upset if you start right. crying. Right, I will. Oh, I'm going to get it, hang on. Whoa, there we go. Whoa. We 
have chicken. to wait. What is he putting in the mall? Chicken. Oh, oh. 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 look, you've got oh. penguins. Mom, I need to go for the mall. Oh. That was a number one, right? Yeah, it was. Oh, you get a toy. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you get a toy in yours. Do you know how you're doing it? I don't know how to do it. Come here. So, what did you get? You oh, have okay. to go for obviously yeah. number one. I can't open up my door. Hang on, I'll come and help you in a second. Oh, my God. What's that? Oh, what's in it? Oh, it's a pirate. Pirate, is it now? Oh, a pirate. I've got a pirate. Wow. Go on, Casper. You might get the same thing. Yeah. There you go. What did you get? Did you get a pirate as well? Oh, I can't wait. And wait. this is like your. Well, I don't it's know where like it is. Maybe a treasure map type of thing. Yeah, yeah, you get toys in every day. So, this on the floor here is. You obviously open that up and then you put that underneath your advent calendar and then it has all of the different things on it. Is that good? Can you manage, Max? Can I help you? No, I'm just dumb. I didn't open it. Oh, yeah. Have you managed to get in the doors? But have you got your? Have you got yours, Tilly? Yeah, that's a good one. Yeah, I'm gonna look for number two. Actually, where's yours? What did you get? Did you get a farmer? Yeah. Oh, is that a chicken? Oh no. Did you drop him? He got in. Yeah. Right, sure. number one. Yep, yep, it is. Imagine if you get Harry Potter, give it to me, please. Oh. Something tells me that's Harry Potter. Yep, that's Harry Potter. Hi, Harry Potter. Yeah, so you got to build your Lego bits then, haven't you? You got Harry Potter. Time to get to work, Mum. Bonnie got it. Oh, yeah, we'll have to just be careful. Don't rip that, that part of it. There's a bridge on the top. I know. Top it's hard, though. There we go. So the girls have been in here like just doing their advent calendars, didn't you? And Hallie's decided it would be a great idea to open quite a few of the boxes. Which is not a great idea, is it Hallie? <laughs> Wait a minute, it's fine. Just let's not... Yes, you did. Just leave it, it's fine. So she's opened number one, which... And I think she's opened that one. Anyway, we just don't get one tomorrow because you've opened the number two, didn't you, sweetheart? Never mind. But are you going to show everybody which one you got? Whoa. I got the bottle from number two. Did you? This big guy. This big guy. Oh, you probably got the bottle. Yeah, so how many did you Did you open that one? No, I was doing them that. Then it oh, right, well, that's excellent. So don't open it. It just will mean that we don't have to do it open one tomorrow. That's all, isn't it? Look at these, Noel. Is that her thing coming Yeah, but, well, she's snuck a few more out of it. Ali! <laughs> but it's all right. We, she tried to get it to 24, obviously couldn't get into it. But she's just had the number one and number two. And Phoebe, I think, has just had number one. Phoebe, did you just open one? Yeah, good girl. That's, that's good. Three's <laughs> tiny. Oh, do you like it? Three's tiny. Hi, Ivy. Right, what did we get here? What did we get here? What? We've got a snowman. We've got a tree. And me too. And me too. So, what did you get in your... Did you get... Oh, look. Yeah. Yeah. Right, so we need to put these away so that yeah, they don't get broken. Only one day is going so well so far, is it? Mm, no. Callie, how many dogs? Callie, what are you trying to do, darling? What are you trying Can to you do? Take that door. Oh, it's fine. Let's just leave it because when it comes to twenty-four, we'll open it. It's fine. Let's just leave it like that, okay? Oh yeah, that's fine. Did Dave enjoy his breakfast? Yeah. Good. What did he have? Did he have a pancake and some strawberries? Yes, some strawberries. Mum, I don't know how you eat pancakes. Yeah. You want to look what the kids are doing in the dining room? I've just caught them. Oh, what, are you, what are you doing? Just hiding. Are you hiding? Yeah. Where's the elf? You can touch that one. You're allowed to touch that one because that's your toy. Yeah. Look at this. It's Jade put you on the scooter. Hey. Do you want a little 
Rachel, go on the scooter. Archie picked him up. Get baby Bonnie was like, hide, hide. No, Bonnie, we can't do that. <gasps> no, we have to sit him there. You're not to touch him. The face is like, what? Bonnie, don't touch him. He'll lose his magic. And then he'll have to fly away to the North Pole to go get magic again. Oh, fine. But he won't be able to fly to the North Pole. Because he'll lose his magic. He can fly. Yeah? Fly up my room. Up your room. Oh, look, and there's sparkles. Careful. Hiya. How cool are these elf balloons? We got them from somebody on Instagram that lives um, around here. And they're really good. It just says on the balloon, wear back. And uh, we got one obviously for Buddy and then another one for Sparkles. But the kids actually love them. Oh, I think we got a delivery. Well, we were going to go out for a little walk after we'd had some lunch, but Heidi's just been really, really windy this morning no. and I think she's a bit no. overtired. So, so I put her down for a little sleep. Oh, don't shout. Put her down for a little nap and if she wakes up then we'll go out um, before the kids get back from school. But I've got a feeling that she probably will sleep for a few hours because, like I say, she'd not slept very well last night and then I think she's just been really tired. What are we watching on the telly, Archie? Monsters Inc. We are, aren't we? We're watching Monsters Inc. Bonnie's got her little sloth. Haven't you, Bonnie? Have you got your sloth? Yeah. <laughs> the dogs are just being idiots down there. We've got Mabel here. Oh, I need to show you this blanket. Look at this blanket that somebody sent us from. She's got an Instagram page called Pickle Puss. Um, it's this one here, look. Pickle Puss. And she sent this for us and I absolutely love it. The Radford Family Christmas. And it's obviously red on the other side. And um, yeah, it's proven very popular. The kids will come home from school, get the blanket and snuggle on their sofa, won't they? Don't pick your nose. Should we get the blanket seen us all watching Monsters Inc? And we'll have a bit of a snuggle on the sofa. Yeah, yeah. And hopefully Heidi will wake up fairly soonish and yeah, then we can yeah, go out for a little yeah. walk, can't we? But for now, we're going to chill on the sofa. Look at these two. <laughs> Did it come off the track? Did Bonnie do it? Bonnie, did you take it off the track? <laughs> I'll tell you what, Arch, why don't you stop it and then put it on? Might be a bit easy, mightn't it? If you stop it. Hang on, it stopped. Do you need to turn it the right way? Hang on a minute. I think it is actually stuck on something, isn't it? Mind your legs out of the way for a minute. Is that better? I don't think that's on the track, though, is it? Oh, we've got a derailment. Is it derailed? We fell. Bluebell, what have you done? You've derailed the track, the train off the track. Go on. Bonnie, what have you done? Hang on, let's just turn it off. Well, Noel's just got back from work with my advent calendar. He's got me an advent calendar. Oh, just take the flat side out of my pants. Yeah. Oh, I'm excited. I don't know why I'm excited yet. <laughs> How do we even like... I think you're taking out the box at the base and then it should open yeah, up, there. I think. Right. And does it open up? Yeah. Hang on, on a minute. Hang on, Mum. Dun, dun, dun! Oh, oh my word. Look at that. Oh, my goodness. Look at that. Oh, oh my gosh. Look, look. it's number one. All right, I need my phone. I'm going to take oh, a picture. Oh, wow. <gasps> that looks really good. That looks really good. Oh, oh, well, there's number one. Oh, look. Oh, oh. Oh, look. What, it folds? Yeah, but no, it's got them on this side as well. Look. Oh, right, yeah. Where's number one at? Yeah. Right, it's going to be a big candle, I think. Hang on. You don't get any of the massive ones. Oh, are you ready for this? Are you ready? 
Are we ready? Are we steady? Oh, oh my word. Oh, oh, it's a big one. Oh, the candle! But it's empty. Oh, it's empty. <laughs> yes, it is! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, you must have oh, well, just like... See, that's really little thing. And then, obviously, tomorrow, which is number two, which I don't know where it is, we'll get a thing that we can put in there. Well, hopefully. Yeah, you don't, don't you? Oh, it's there. Oh, and it looks like it's quite a big one. <laughs> you know? So, guys, that bit of the vlog you've just been watching was recorded uh, a few days ago. Uh, so it might seem a little bit odd. So everything seems to be upside down at the minute. Uh, basically what happened is uh, a little while ago I felt cold and fluey so I rung up 111 and just sort of explained to them you know what how I feel and what have you do I need to get a test the Covid test and the lady at the other end of the phone advised me no you, you don't need to um, you haven't ticked the correct boxes as such to warrant going for a test so I thought okay that's good happy days anyway a few days later I sort of lost my sense of smell, so I thought, okay, better ring back, see what she says this time. So anyway, I went through it again, and she says, oh no, it's coming back, sort of advising you to go for a test. So, uh, booked a test that night, and went the next morning for a test. And my results came back just over 24 hours later, and positive. So, we are all having to self-isolate for the next... Well, I don't, I don't know how many days we've got less now, to be honest. Everything seems to be upside down and we're all going a bit stir crazy, to be honest. We're in the house bored, as they say. So now we're waiting on Amy and Daniel's results to come back because they, they started the symptoms same time as me. Uh, so just wait for their results to come back because they went a little, a few days later after me. Anyway. So that's where we're up to. Um, really though, I would, have, I would say to anyone that's feeling like they've got the flu, the cold, let me turn my tongue dryer off. Anyone that's feeling like they've got the cold or the flu or anything like that, uh, you know, ring mom mom on, see what they say. But do you know what I think I would advise? Book yourself in for a test, just to make sure that you either have or you haven't got it because you just don't know. Some people are showing more symptoms than others and really, you know, I think we should get tested just in case we have got it but we aren't showing the, the usual symptoms that come with COVID. And in that way, you know, you're not spreading it onto your loved ones or somebody else that it could affect drastically and, you know, it could almost kill them or whatever, put them in hospital for weeks on end. Luckily, I've just had... Um, no sense of smell and a bit of a cough, I would have said, for a few days. <clears throat> and it sort of feels like you've got a, a bit of a lump in your chest, I would say. You know, you can feel, you can sort of feel where the infection is, I guess. Maybe that's what it is. But anyway, that's where we're up to. Um, so we're just going to doss about in the house. Not much we can do, really. Go in the garden. Um, we've booked a few delivery slots for the home delivery for the shopping. Sophie came down the other night, last night, the night before, uh, with some shopping for us because <clears throat> I buggered up the home delivery. I thought I booked it in for the whatever day it was, but seemingly I booked it in for the week after. So we got no shopping that day, so that was a bit of a disaster. So Sophie went out and got some for us. Anyway, not to worry. So that's where we're up to. Uh, obviously, we'll let you know when Amy and Daniel's results come back. Um, but honestly, we we seem fine. All of us are. It's the loss of smell that we've all suffered in this house. I think the three of us. Uh, but besides that, a bit of a chesty cough for myself. But the other two, just nothing. So honestly, honestly, guys, I really do recommend any s symptoms at all, even if it's just cold and flu. Like, just go and get the test. You just never know. You know, stay at home, get it done and protect somebody out there that's probably more vulnerable than yourselves. Anyway, so that's where we're up to. And I'm trying to keep away from the kids as much as I can, which you can imagine is pretty difficult in this out. Look, there's one wandering in now. Where's he gone? Oh, he's gone round there. Yeah. Oh, well, that's it for today's vlog. I'm sorry it's a bit all over the place, but things have just been a bit 
a bit crazy the past few days really well for the past week um trying to adjust to obviously not being able to get go out um the shopping side of it a biscuit you've had the biscuit no more um and i think by the end of the isolation period we'll all be going a bit stir crazy but anyway the main thing is we're all fine it all seems to be much better than it was a few days ago which is good um so anyway we will keep you all updated bye for now guys